Welcome by joining here for Anders interview session here today. We got FlyQuest here. Hi guys, we are FlyQuest. Hey guys, I'm Lucio, FlyQuest support. Hi, I'm Whippo, I'm the FlyQuest top laner. Uh, I'm inspired, um, I'm jungler for FlyQuest and uh, I hope you guys will get to know me a little bit better here. That was long. Uh, hi guys, I'm Jensen and I'm the mid laner for FlyQuest. I'm Masu and I'm the FlyQuest ADC. Um, yeah, I think uh, the biggest difference is that the uh, enemy team always has a good plan like in the draft and then they know how to execute their plan well. So you have to be really focused and like uh, not make mistakes because if you play in LCS I feel like uh, players are just weaker so you can kind of still get away with mistake and win the game. But here at the MSI I think if you, if you don't play well or like you make one mistake enemy can take over the game. So you have to be really focused and and have a good plan going into the game. I think it was just kind of how the draft went, where it's like, it's like focused a lot on the early game because of both teams' team comp. So there was just gonna be a lot of fighting early on, and if you lose early on against team comps where it's a lot about the early game, then the game uh, becomes pretty quick, yeah. It would have to be Guma, Guma Yushi, I think. Um, when I played against him, I think I didn't play too well because I was nervous, but at the same time I could tell just how good he was, just how much like uh, pressure he put in the lane and how smart he played the lane out. He knew exactly what he wanted to do and when to do it, so. I think Top Esports is a fantastic team. I have a lot of history with the players. Uh, their top lane in 369 knocked me out of Worlds in uh, 2020. Uh, their jungler Tian knocked me out of Worlds in 2019 and their AD carry Jackie Love knocked me out of Worlds in 2018. So for me, mm, I would have loved to play them on stage and um, gotten to see where I measure up against them after so many years. But uh, I have a lot of fond memories from those years and I have a lot of respect for those individual players. Adjustable, comfortable, great looking. I'd say quality and uh, durability. Quality, comfort, appearance, good looks. It is really comfortable. I think the armrests are really interesting. I've never really had armrests like this. And um, it feels like it supports my elbow a bit more. The comfort overall feels the same. Maybe this one is a bit more comfortable in terms of um, softness. The cushion feels nicer. The cushion and everything feels really nice and yeah, I mean, this is just like a crazy chair. I've actually never seen anything like this before. Mm, the first impression is for sure the pillow here. It's very comfortable. <laughs> when I sit down, I feel like I'm sitting on the bed. <laughs> it just feels nice. It's very relaxing. I notice the cushion where I'm sitting on is much softer. <laughs> it's uh, very comfortable, actually. <laughs> the other thing is, is when I'm trying to you know, sit as if I would play, um, I can immediately tell that I have more support on my elbows as well um, when I play. Very adjustable, but I also like the green one because you know, fly quest. So, starting off by quick question Who's the biggest prankster on this team? This guy, prankster? I'm not. I'm not the prankster. <laughs> what did you do? I don't know, I'm not a prankster. So when we leave, he pulls up stuff on our PCs. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, okay, that, is okay. It like, I, I'm a prankster in that way. <laughs> is it like a juicy piece of food in the PC of yours? Yeah, when someone yeah. leaves the room, I like to put some stuff on the PC and then they come back and they're just surprised. <laughs> You're kind of bad. <laughs> I didn't go yet, but we are planning to go see the pandas because everyone, everyone is telling me that I should go see the pandas while I'm here in Chengdu. I've had hot pot twice, and both times I liked it a lot. But other than that, I haven't really left the hotel much, so not much to judge off, but all the hotel food was also good. 